Before jumping in, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any of our weekly uploads. Summer is here and you need plants that can withstand the heat. The four plants we've picked for you can do just that, and then some. If you want to attract pollinators, include a statement piece to your yard and or add a pop of color, we got you covered. Stay tuned to get the inside scoop on this summer's hottest plant selections. Let's jump right in and start off with one of our most popular plants, the star jasmine. Star jasmines flourish in areas that receive full sun, making them perfect for summer. Plus, they attract tons of pollinators such as bees and butterflies with their sweet-smelling fragrance that will linger all around your garden. This is a southern plant and they grow best in USDA zones 8 through 11. They are quite drought tolerant, which is another good reason to have them in your garden this upcoming summer. Only water them if you notice that the first 1 to 2 inches of soil are dry, and then only water enough to wet the first 5 to 6 inches of soil from the top. Typically, you should be deep watering your jasmine regularly every 10 to 21 days, or up to twice a week if it's a particularly hot season. If you choose to keep this plant in a container, be sure to water it more often. Feel free to prune your jasmine to sculpt a desired shape and encourage new growth. Sticking with the high fragrance trend, we'd love to introduce you to the butterfly bush. Butterfly bushes truly live up to their name as they are guaranteed to bring plenty of helpful garden bugs your way. They smell amazing and their flowers add pops of color wherever you place them. Use a well-draining soil and place your butterfly bush in full sun for maximum flower production. The rest of your plants will flourish when a butterfly bush is placed nearby, thanks to our pollinator friends. Though drought tolerant, be sure not to underwater, especially in cases of extreme heat. Another popular summer plant is the crepe myrtle tree, and there are so many different varieties to choose from. Once established, this southern plant only needs supplemental watering if your area receives less than 20 inches of rain per year. Depending on the variety, a mature plant will reach up to 8 to 30 feet tall. The crepe myrtle makes a beautiful small tree and can be used as a privacy screen or hedge if 3 to 5 plants are used. Its beautiful flowers and attractive bark truly make this plant a statement piece. Its blooms will last all summer up until the first frost. This plant is deciduous, so it will lose its foliage in the winter, but will rebloom the following spring. And last but certainly not least, we have one of our favorite decorative shrubs, the sunshine ligustrum. This bush truly lives up to its name and adds a huge burst of color to your space. While it looks good standing alone, the ligustrum sunshine can be grown into a golden hedge if multiple plants are used. These plants are evergreen and they maintain their color throughout the year. We recommend making sure that it receives at least 6 hours of full sun a day and planting it in moist, well-draining soil. In addition to its heat tolerance, it can also withstand cold temperatures as low as negative 10 degrees Fahrenheit. Not to mention, it's also pest and disease resistant, so if you're looking for low maintenance, you got it. Share your summer garden by tagging us at MyPerfectPlants on Instagram. Until next time, happy planting.